wanted to tell you about a project that Heritage Restoration participated in back in May of 2019 with Whale, who are the Waterfront Historic Area League of New Bedford. This was for the First Baptist Church in William Street in New Bedford, which had fallen into some disrepair over the years. In the spring of 2014, Whale had received some funding to determine the feasibility of fixing up the church. And they finally had received some funding uh, back in 2018, to which they hired Heritage to reconstruct the lantern portion of the project, which is the section above the belfry itself. Heritage went out and documented the existing moldings and determined uh, a lot of the details um, that weren't able to be de determined by the architect. And we began to lay out each of the parts and build the walls in our shop. Each part was carefully considered to make sure longevity was uh, of the utmost importance, as well as authenticity towards the original design and intent. We used uh, machines from the 1940s, like the Williams and Hussey, which made us the solid crown moldings, as well as some of the other details that originally adorned the uh, lantern itself. The steeples finial was uh, original, and we found that the wrought iron was in pretty remarkable condition underneath all of that rust, which was removed using a needle scaler, and we applied a uh, hard coat uh, Rust-Oleum product on top of it to ensure that it had uh, proper longevity. We reproduced the original base, which was built like a mast, and uh, reused the collar that went around it. Uh, each part was packaged at the shop and transported to site, where we worked with uh, sort of the site managers uh, who were preparing the lantern. We set up at the beginning of May uh, and began to assemble all of the pieces we fabricated in the shop uh, according to the specifications of uh, increased bracing uh, for wind loads uh, and making sure that uh, the internal system allowed drainage uh, when water would get through uh, the siding that we put on. All of the Sippo mahogany was back primed and uh, screwed with stainless steel screws into place. Um, since some of the pieces were over two inches thick, uh, which is a bit deceiving from the ground. The lantern being made on the ground enabled us to have it lifted with a crane into place, which was uh, a remarkable feat by the engineers and crane operators on site. It was uh, an exciting day for all involved, knowing that an effort of over five years would culminate uh, into the uh, fabrication and assembly of the iconic lantern, who sat so prominently in downtown New Bedford for so long uh, and was particularly known as a national landmark as well as a uh, national treasure by one of its members. Uh, creating Robert's Rules of Orders for Parliamentary Procedures. But it's more important that the building lives on as a useful structure. Uh, in this case, it's uh, going to be a theater, which is a fantastic addition to a increasingly vibrant downtown. And this is one of the many projects that Heritage is asked to complete that is unique and outside of everyday contracting norms, uh, but also requires the careful coordination of all involved. Thanks again to Whale for entrusting Heritage Restoration in this awesome project, and keep tuning in and subscribe. Thanks very much.